Meanwhile, Jalapong Royal Academy Secretary General Professor Dr. Niti Mahanon has proposed a reprioritization of Thailand's strategies to cope with the third wave of the pandemic, which is rapidly spreading far and wide to the point that we do not know who are infected among the people around us. In his Facebook post, he said that the top priority now is not to protect those who are not infected or to prevent the infected from spreading the disease, as it was when infections were not widespread, but it's now about the management of hospital beds, intensive care units in particular, and of human resources to take care of patients. He proposed the scaling down of proactive case finding so there will be sufficient resources to focus on people who think they may be infected or develop mild symptoms so they will get tested. Those who have no symptoms and who can help themselves need not to be admitted to hospitals but should isolate themselves at home in order not to waste hospital beds which should be reserved for those who need them the most. While ensuring sufficient beds in hospitals, he suggested a publicity campaign should be launched to educate the people about how to protect themselves and their families from the disease and about when to go to the hospital. Adding that it does not matter if the message is repetitive as Thai people are willing to listen. Professor Niti said he recommends the rapid administering of medication to non-severe cases instead of allowing the virus to attack their lungs and then give them the antiviral medication. He said those found infected should be treated immediately with the medications, as was the case with influenza, without having to wait for research papers about this method of treatment. Professor Niti also said that doctors must adapt to the situation as he suggested they should forget that they are specialists in certain medical fields and make themselves available to take care of COVID-19 patients. He also said that in times of war, soldiers, whether they are infantrymen, sailors or cavalrymen, police or volunteers must all grab a weapon to fight the enemy or COVID-19 under the present circumstances. About the vaccines, the CRA Secretary General suggested that the people should get inoculated quickly and not be too selective. He asked the public not to worry too much about the importance of the immune system produced by each make of the vaccine, noting that there are several more factors contributing to infection by the virus, the onset of symptoms, and the protection from infection.